Hello, my dear friends. What kind of a picture do you have on God? You may be a Christian, you may be a Hindu, you may be a Muslim, or whatever you may be, or you may not uh, have a real picture of God. But I just ask you, what kind of uh, um, way you think about God? The God of Bible has a particular picture. It is not the picture which is very prevalent in many places. Many of the people think that God is something or somebody who uh, gives punishment. He is a judging God. He is like a police. Is it so, my dear friends? The God of Bible whom I understand is somebody which is portrayed or who is portrayed at this weekend on Sunday in all the Catholic Masses. This we see from the book of wisdom in the Old Testament. I just read for you the text which we are going to listen on Sunday Masses. Before the Lord, the whole universe is as a grain from balance or a drop of morning dew come down upon the earth. But you have mercy on all because you can do all things and you overlook people's sins that they may repent. For you love all things that are and loathe nothing that you have made. For you, for what you hated, you would not have fashioned. And how could a thing remain unless you willed it or be preserved had it not been called forth by you? But you spare all things because they are yours. O Lord, and lover of souls, for your imperishable spirit is in all things. Therefore, you rebuke offenders little by little, warn them and remind them of the sins that they are committing, that they may abandon their wickedness and believe in you, O Lord. Yes, my dear friends, these are the words which we are getting um, from the Book of Wisdom. Beautiful words. That means the God of Bible is not somebody who is just uh, waiting with a stick to beat us. He is God of mercy. He can endure um, patience. He can wait for us. Yes, his wisdom is so high. His love is so deep that he cannot just punish us, my dear friends. He just waits that we repent. The same thing we see also in many places in the New Testament with Jesus. He is just going towards the sinners and he is not waiting that these sinners will perish. On the other hand, they should repent. They should come back to the worthy of being children of God. That is the will of God. That is the will of God of Bible. That means he is not for the wickedness of the people, of the human beings. He is willing that we become like him, like he. Yes, my dear friends, in that way we can understand that God is always loving us. He is patient and He is good. He is good, really good. So let us have another picture of God or let us change the picture of God that we don't be fearful or we don't have fear um, in front of God. We just love Him and we just go back towards him so that
people can see through us the living God, uh, God of mercy. I wish you all the best. Have a wonderful Sunday and a week. Bye-bye. Thank you.